Real quick, this tutorial is meant for people who already have your 5PD and 5M servers set up and ready to go and you just want to make yourself an admin inside of the MDT system. If you haven't done this, go watch this video first and then come back here. Let's get in. Hello, and I've been asked a lot recently on how you can make yourself an admin inside of the MDT system for 5PD. So I'm going to just show you how you can do this. Make sure you are on duty in the F11 menu, make, and then get inside of any police vehicle. If you're using add-on vehicles, make sure they have the emergency flag. This will only work when the car is standing still for drivers, but it does work all the time for passengers in the vehicle if you're moving. Then you just go ahead and press B, and you can see it opens up this system where it says 5PD computer system. You'll see nothing but this admin code thing at the bottom. If you are not on the latest version or you keep kept your config over previous versions, you won't see this admin code thing. If you don't, we're going to go over in a moment how you can do this, uh, setting yourself as an admin without this, but the easiest way is to use the admin code. To get your admin code, you can go into your files, which is in your fi uh, resources and then server data resources 5pd folder, go to your config.json file, edit it with notepad++ or notepad, and just go to the bottom and you can see admin code. And for me, the admin code is admin. And then I can just go back into the game, type in admin, press enter, and you can see I now can create a new department, delete departments, and have access to create it. Another way you can do this is doing it through the database. So you can go ahead and open up your local host or a, um, your PHP my admin. To get here, you can type localhost slash, I can't type, localhost slash PHP my admin. I don't have it on this port, but if I did, it would automatically redirect me to a page that looks like this and make sure you already have your databases imported and everything if you don't know how to import a database we went over this in our tutorial video on how to create a 5pd server you can then go over to your users tab which is this label right here and you can see your username so you want to find your in-game name and make sure is admin is set to uh, one instead of zero so since i set myself as an admin inside of the mdt over here it's is admin over here is one but if i set this to a zero and it will remove my admin if i go back into the game and restart 5pd you'll see i'm no longer an admin and if i try to open up the mdt you'll see i see the admin code again so if i switch this back to is admin to one and I go ahead and restart the server or restart 5PD itself by pressing F8 and typing restart 5PD. And then I go ahead and open up the MDT once going back on duty. You can see I have admin perms just like this. So those are the two ways you can do this quite easy. Um, thank you to the users who asked us to make a tutorial on how to do this because I know a lot of people have been getting confused how you can manually do it in the database. But it's as easy as opening up the PHP My Admin page and editing it just like you would have done when importing the SQL file earlier in the tutorial videos. If you haven't set it up your 5M server or 5PD server, make sure to go ahead and click the cards in the top right hand corner and click on the full setup tutorial video and it should help you out on how to set up your server. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Noodles and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.